The House of Representatives on Tuesday issued a 14-day ultimatum to cement fact manufacturers in the country to appear before it or face legislative sanctions. This was stated at a joint investigative hearing on the arbitrary increase in the price of cement in Nigeria by the Chairman House Committee on Solid Minerals, Honorable Gaza Jonathan, and Co-Chairman of the Committee on Commons, Industry and Special Duties. The committee also summoned to appear before the committee on May 21 the Minister of Solid Minerals, Delia Lake, over the matter. While expressing displeasure over the non-appearance of critical stakeholders at the hearing, Honorable Jonathan says there is no court injunction restraining the communities or the committees from carrying out its constitutional mandate. Earlier, the Speaker of the House of Representatives, Honorable Abbas Tajuddin, ex represented by his deputy, Honorable Benjamin Kalu, decried the housing deficit in the country while reaffirming the House resolves to establish appropriate legislation that will promote and encourage industrialization as well as support small and medium enterprises. We are ignoring and taking for granted the importance of what we are trying to do today. In January, one of the companies had actually said they were going to sell cement for 3,500 naira a bag. One of the companies. Why this arbitrary increase from 4,500 to as much as 13 to 15,000 and right now is stabilizing at about 10,000 to 12,000? It is still too high. And who are those at the short end of the stick? Who are those suffering? It is you and I. So please, uh, we are taking this time so that we can actually emphasize and underpin the importance of this investigation to the people of Nigeria. The Federal Ministry of Works, at the inception of this administration, said they want to turn to work. For, for roads. Cement. So with this increase, what do you think is going to happen to our budgetary uh, utilization and allocation? If a, a, a one kilometer of road using cement at a price of 4,500 is, is, let's say, 4.5 million, now that same road, we're looking at it going for over 9 million. So every little thing here has a multiplier effect. And we must curb it. And as God is our witness, that is all we are elected to do. And work. What is that? The persistent rise in current cement prices has led and had a detrimental impact not only on the built environment, but also on the entire economy. Cement is a fundamental component used in construction of projects like bridges, dams, houses, waterworks, and road infrastructure. This makes addressing this issue paramount. As you all know, it is self-evident that we have a huge housing deficit presently in Nigeria. According to a study by researchers of the African Development Bank, the Housing Market Dynamics in Africa book. There is a housing deficit of up to 16.9 million units. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.